Paige, I guess your first thoughts on just the results. Yeah, I mean, I thought we were absolutely great in the first half. Um, and then second half being down a man, it's just difficult. Um, Rain adjusted at halftime. Um, so it's disappointing to let two goals in in the second half, but also I think we have to remember they're a good team and we got the point. So um, I think that will help us later. Walk us through your goal. Yeah, honestly, <laughs> I felt in my flow state tonight. So sometimes as an athlete, I feel like they can relate where you kind of black out because you're so focused on the game. Um, but I saw it was just like a misclearance on the defender and I knew to get in a good position and I knew just to bring it down and um, hit it low and hard back post. And yeah, it, was, it felt really good to score my first racing goal. Do you feel like this was a more consistent game for racing when you played throughout the season so far? Definitely. I mean, again, I know, like, if you look at the stats, it's like, oh, how did they score two goals in the second half? But at the same time, for down a man, a lot was happening, PK, unfortunate. Um, so I think it's coming together. You know, it's a marathon, not a sprint. Um, so I think just remembering that is super important. This is a second game that was, you know, results were dropped because of personal mistakes, I think we can say. So how is a locker room hold each other accountable and to make sure that that doesn't keep repeat out? Yeah, I mean, for me, I think I made a personal mistake at Angel City, and we tied 2-2, two -two, and it really sings. It's hard to swallow, but I think you just have to look at it as a opportunity to grow. So I think one thing really special is this group that, um, as much as I sit here and say Angel City is my fault, my teammates are the first ones to say, no, 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 um, we will be better in this moment. We'll learn from this. So I just encourage my teammates to do the same. Tell us more about the flow state. What does that mean? How hard is it to get there? Yeah, I think um, so closely as an athlete, I just, it's when it, you're not thinking, you're just free. Um, it's like a focus of freedom and you're having fun. So I think for me, when I'm in that flow state is when I'm my best. And tonight feeling that way was really good. And um, that's one thing I can leave really happy about. On a whole, what do you think is, is next for the team? How close do you feel like you are to getting those three points and really pushing yeah, I think we have this week to work on to figure out how we're going to manage a game. You know, I've spoke about that before, but just the little things I think we could tidy up on and um, just work as a unit. So I think this week of training is going to be huge for us, um, setting up for Orlando next week. Hey, you played a lot of soccer. There's a lot of young players on this team, and I think they're still getting used to maybe being in the media and entering out of it. What do you try to teach them from this city? Is there a constant lesson that comes to your mind? Yeah, I just think managing the game, and Abby actually talked about this, um, winning is a habit, so we just have to get into the habit of winning. So I think it's honestly in training. We need to train. We're down to nothing. You know, we're up to nothing. Like, what do we do differently in those moments? Um, that comes with experience, and that comes with personal mistakes. Um, like I said, Angel City for me comes to mind. I don't think I'll ever let that happen again. So um sometimes we have to learn from our mistakes but honestly i'm glad it's happening at the beginning of the season so that we could grow and get better how do you how do you not get frustrated as a team by this and get you know kind of bogged down and feel like oh we're in a slot and haven't got three points how do you take this and fire yourself up now? Honestly, I think it's just one of those things we have to look at ourselves and say, like, what do we want from this? Like, do we want to throw our hands up and complain and be frustrated and, oh, what's happening? You know, why is this always happening to us and feel sorry for ourselves? Or are we going to get up and fight? Um, so one thing about this team I think is super special is we do have that fighting spirit, uh, but it's just getting that over the line. But I think once we get those three points, the ball will just get rolling. Are you surprised that Sav got the second yellow yeah, of course. I mean, I think in those moments, um, I personally think she was just trying to keep the ball alive and it just went off her foot way too hard. But um, again, we learn from our mistakes, um, mistake or not. I just think we could be better in those moments. Anything else for Paige? 